Hey church fam, just want to add in another thought regarding our heart of leadership as we've been coming through that series. Um, if I could say it like this, we're in a very strategic season at Impact Church. Very strategic season. This series that we did was strategic. Um, even these conversations we're having on Friday nights are very strategic. And there's a reason for it. We believe that God is getting us ready for the harvest that is ahead. He's getting us ready for the growth that is ahead. Uh, we're already growing, which is awesome. We're going to continue to grow, which is amazing. But we need to intentionally and strategically raise people up, uh, stretch people, challenge people, develop people, coach people, so that they can confidently walk in the things that God has for their lives. You're going to start to see some of those changes and that intentionality happen even on Sunday morning starting this summer. We're going to have different people leading our pre-service prayer. We're going to have some people in our church that are going to be starting the service with our call to worship. You're going to see a new role that we're going to create called a service host that is going to be doing our welcome and our transition to video announcements. As well, we're actually doing something this summer called a 3 by 10 We're doing it over a couple of Sundays where you're going to see three different people do a 10-minute God talk on one of the parables of Jesus Christ. Um, I have to admit, we're stealing the idea from Ignite Youth from last week because they did an amazing job having their five people do about five to ten minutes each, and they did awesome. Love the idea. So we're going to do that with six different people this summer. We're also going to have some different people lead communion. Uh, this summer. We're going to just, again, we're going to be stretching some people. We want to see what's in, inside of them and what's on them. And so you're going to see that starting this summer. I want to also share with you a couple of other ways to grow into leadership. We're actually going to be intentionally developing team leads for our Sunday morning service teams. Not all of them, but for example, you'll see this with guest services. You're going to see it with production. You're actually going to see it midweek with some of our outreaches because we want to start to develop leadership skills in people. And the only way you can do that is by being in the game. So we're going to be doing that uh, strategically over the next several months. As well, I also want to just plant the seed for small group leadership. We believe with all of our hearts that the best way to care for people, to connect with people, to grow people are in small groups. And so we want to encourage you to prayerfully consider leading a small group this September. Um, we believe with all of our hearts that is a great opportunity to grow, to be stretched in your leadership. And so if you have any questions about that, I want to encourage you to email me at Cameron at ImpactKingston.com as I'd love to be able to help you on that journey to discover what God has on you and how to kind of, if I can say, fan into flame the gift of God and the call of God on your life. Um, we want to see people grow at impact. We want to see them activated. We want to see them equipped for what God has. And so we believe that as we do that step by step, maybe little by little, little stretches by little stretches, we're going to see you grow and become all that God has intended in your life. Why are we doing this? Why are we strategically, intentionally developing leaders in this season? Well, it's very simple. We want to be, a handle, we want to be able to handle the growth that is coming. And if we have the current list of leaders and that's where we stay, we're not going to be able to handle it. But we want to handle it. We want to grow. We want to be able to stretch and to handle the people that God is bringing uh, into our care. And so, church, I want to just say to you, be prayerful. Get in God's grill. Get in his face in, a, in the best way possible and ask him, Lord, what is my role? What is my place in this season? Amen, church. We'll see you Sunday for a great day.